Welcome back, everybody, to Heroes and Brews with Nerdy Dudes. Today, your friendly neighborhood bureaus are going to introduce you to another hashtag BOTW. If you don't know what that means, Kevin, tell them what day is it. It's Beer of the Week Day! And for this Beer of the Week Day, we have a very cool, very exciting can design, right? It's Kachok and Brewing Company. It's partnered with Giant, the grocery store. I saw this and I called Kev because I thought this was cool. And it is called One Giant Leap. Love the can design, dude. Talk about the can design. We got the giant logo. We got the astronaut. We got some, is this orange? No, mango, sorry. Mango. Like, Kev, come on. Dude, this is probably one of their best can designs that they have ever had. Because normally their can designs, and, and I'm not I'm not trying to discredit them. I, I love all of Kachakin's can designs. Normally with their beers, on a lot of their flagship beers, they'll have their 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 logo, which is a man on a bicycle, and it'll kind of be, um, it'll be a checkered pattern, like different color checkered pattern. Exactly. Although Type A, Type A is 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 completely separate from what I just described. And then they they released the new unfiltered Pilsner. It has like the Liberty Bell on it. Um, it might be called Liberty Bell. I forget. But um, but this is like such a cool, striking design. Um, it almost has like a comic book feel to it. Yeah, uh, the astronauts, that bold black outline. I yeah, it, it does look very comic bookish, and I just think it looks very sleek, very crisp, like mm-hmm. a nice clean design. Um, and you know the background just it it pops too. It makes the astronaut like show off even more with the black outline because of like the di- the uh, the stripes going out. I think it's really yeah, cool. Man. It's really really cool. Uh, uh, what I- one of my favorite can designs, like in a while, um, and, and the thing is, I remember seeing it online that they were doing this, and then forgot about it until I went to go pick beer up, and then and saw this. They it was at Giant, obviously, and they had this by the register, and it was so striking. I was like, "What the hell is that?" And then I looked, and I was like, "Oh my god, that's a Kachahakin Giant collab." Um, that's the same. That's the way it got me. I was walking with Jess. I forget what we were grabbing for her. And I just was like, whoa, orange, mango, astronaut, giant logo. I'm like, Kasha Hawkins on there. I need this. Grab the four pack. I'm like, here we go. Beer of the week right here. Awesome. And uh, well, we've been talking about the can design so much. What do you think of the? the I haven't even tasted it yet. I know you jumped the gun. I have yet to. I've yet to put this beer to my lips. I'm about to, but if you want to explain how you like it, the floor is yours, sir. I love it. I love it. It it's so it's it's so refreshing this beer. Um, I, I don't know. It's just it's it's really really good. Um, it definitely is very refreshing. I mean, I love mangoes. Like yes. I, I I love a good mango, man. I feel like we don't talk about that fruit enough unless we're talking about it in. Wood rice. Yeah, right. Water. No, uh, it, it is. You can you can taste a lot of mango. Actually, it's it's yeah. it's mango heavy and not too overpowering with a sense where it's all you taste, but it's got like a good mix of that flavor in there. I agree with you, and that that's always my thing. Sometimes, um, you know, I, I, citrusy fruits obviously lend itself well to IPAs. It makes sense. The only thing is, I don't want it to be too overpowering where it's like you get hit in the face with whatever fruit they're brewing with yeah you didn't order but, mango juice you ordered a beer with some mango correct, in it. correct. absolutely i know how yeah. you think kev we've been doing this for too long yeah yeah i'm grabbing a beer here i'm not grabbing mango juice um even though mango juice is very refreshing but it doesn't hit you in the face with that I, I, everything's balanced really well yep uh, um good summertime good summertime beer summertime ipa uh I wonder if we're going to, I don't know. I mean, so the description says on the sign, one giant leap mango IPA is an otherworldly collaboration between the giant company and Conchock and Brewing, brewed with a healthy dose of mango puree and brightened by dry hop editions of Sriracha, Sriracha Ace. 
I think I might need glasses. Calypso and Cascade Hops. The beer sings of summer. That it does. And camaraderie. It, it is a very nice... The- Oh, sorry. So finish that thought. It's what? You'll be over the moon. Get oh, it? Because oh, I like that. The manga oh, looks like yeah. a moon. Astronaut, it all makes sense. All coming together for you. This is a very I... good summer IPA. It really is. It is is delicious. It's got that, you know, tropical vibe to it with the mango. Yeah. I hope that, um, it... I hope it does well. Yeah. And I hope because it does well, they at least make it a seasonal, like a seasonal summer. I mean, year round, I'll absolutely, but I would, I would love for to at least be like a seasonal summer beer for them. Yeah. Cause I would pick this, I picked this Jonah. up. Yeah. I pick it up again too. Maybe four or five times over. Maybe if I get drunk enough, just buy a case like I usually do when I get drunk and enjoy things. So, uh, Oh my God, this, this mother ever. <laughs> Like I just went to his apartment the other day and I was just hysterical with like all this beer that was everywhere. And he was everywhere. like, I don't even know. Like I blacked out and just was like, order, order, order. <laughs> I need a beer fridge for the creation yeah, station yeah. so I can just fill it and just sit here, edit, get drunk, film, edit some more, play some video games, stream on the internet, and I'll be set. I agree. A beer fridge. Oh my God. It's like, it, I don't know what I did before beer fridge. I, I think I just put it in a boring, regular fridge. Ew. It was disgusting. Before, then, before, lovely, wait, beer fridge. before the beer fridge, it was the, uh, <laughs> the, the bureau's chest. <laughs> uh, bureau's. Yeah. The bureau's chest. And, wait, do we talk? Where is that? Uh, it's gone. We sold yeah. it. We sold it to charity for the highest bidder. We made like two point five million dollars, and uh, yeah, I'm sorry you never saw any of that, but it happened. Oh, it's it's okay. I don't <laughs> <need> it. <laughs> well, anyway, you keep it. You keep it. Beer of the weekday. We got some fun stuff coming up. Kev and I watched the old guard. We're gonna talk about Gotham PD, and Kev is gonna make his own show called Kitchen It with Kev. <laughs> Because he was cooking it up hardcore today and mm-hmm. making some awesome. What kind of boats was it? Zucchini boats. Oh, dude, it was zucchini boats, and uh, I filled them with taco flavored rice. Uh, at the very end, sprinkled a little pepper jack cheese, put it back in the oven, let that bad boy melt, and then I drizzled a little um, little hot sauce just over that over that boat. Oh, it was good, oh. man. It was good, dude. Yeah, I nailed it. You did. I saw it. I was yeah, jealous. Man. I got hungry. Yeah. He didn't even send some any my way. I had a. I decided to make a frozen meal because I was lazy and was like, you know what? Frozen dinner. Why not? You know what? I, I uh, Laura and I have been watching a lot of Queer Eye, and this is why I've been cooking because watching Queer Eye, I realized uh, I was being a piece of shit, and I need to cook more for my wife, and I need to get my act together. So. um Today, I, I thought to myself, like, no, 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 I'm not going to, like, order something on DoorDash. Take advantage of some product that we have in the fridge there, in the boring regular fridge, and make a meal. And she liked it. I'm She's good to go. Yeah, no food poisoning so far, so I'm happy. There we go. Mm-hmm. Well, we hope you enjoyed this beer of the weekday, because I know I sure did. We'll be mm-hmm. drinking one giant leap all week, so make sure to tune back in with us. We love you. Comment, like, and subscribe. All that fun stuff. And as always, Kev. Cheers. <gasps>